Hello and welcome once again. Daniel Luther Hart, aka Moron Artist, here uh, to do a, a very different kind of arena video. Uh, I've been a big fan of Magic the Gathering for the past few years. Uh, my story is I got back into it about mm, three years ago when my nephew dragged me to a pre release and have been solidly hooked ever since then. The recent event is, unfortunately, I have not been able to play too much Paper Magic due to the fact that uh, I have a crazy schedule. Uh, my Friday nights are always booked. I can't make it out to my local game store. Uh, you know, I, I just don't have the time, unfortunately, to do that. I look forward to the day when my schedule changes and I can make it out to FNM or other events. Uh, so, filling the gap has been arena for me, and I've thoroughly enjoyed it. It's been pretty great for me. Um, it's, it's really filled that need. Uh, mostly I play standard anyway, so it's not a big deal. I understand other people don't like arena because of the limit of formats, which they're changing with historic and all that. But that's not what I'm here to talk about tonight. I'm here to talk about mastery system as you can see i saved up i grinded and saved up some good amount of gems here and we are gonna go into our mastery tree now right here i'm currently at 60 now i'm probably gonna end up before the 26th here uh which is the time when this will then be gone and we'll start a new mastery tree i will probably make a decent way through this i don't know if i'll be able to make it to that 100 slot all the way but i pretty much if you look at this you look at that top up to 72 that's where it ends if you don't pay for the mastery pass so i've made it all the way to 60 which is a decent way now uh, I, I've been flirting with the idea of, ooh, let's buy this. Ooh, yes, we want this. Uh, you know, it is like, uh, I needed to find out if it was retroactive. I didn't need to wait through this. I didn't want to miss out on all this stuff or have to restart the tree all over again. And I'll go all the way back here and uh, start and have to grind all my way up. That's not worth it. I would just wait. However, I have found out that, yes, it is retroactive. Now, the things that I want out of this, well, first of all, let's address the, the cat in the room. Um, no, I'm, I don't need a cat. I don't need a pet cat. I have a real cat. Not made of flames, of course, but that's kind of a, a needless add-in. Now, things that I am looking forward to, yes, I would like to get the Chandra avatar and the sleeves. Cool, not necessary. But, cool add-ons. Uh, the sleeves especially, I don't usually spend any kind of coin or gem on cosmetics. I'll just take whatever I can grind for. Uh, of course, there's a lot of coin. If you look right here, just up to level 6, you know, 100 or 1,500. Plus, we're getting a whole bunch of these for cosmetics, and we got... Ooh. Ooh, you get planes walkers. And then, then just straight up cosmetics. And of course your gems. So with this, I thought I'd take you along as I purchase this thing. Now I'm gonna go in. And we're just gonna do it straight from the store. Like I said. Minute, 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 minute. Oh, oh, okay, so they don't have the bundle deal, they just have this. Well, that kind of makes sense. We're coming to the end of this. I'm sure they would have ended that by now. If somebody were to buy that and try and grind up to 100, oh boy, you'd be sadly disappointed with that purchase. But, here we go. All I gotta do is click the button, and then it's mine. I've spent a long time getting these gems, so I can buy this. Why am I finding it hard to click the button? Hmm. Oh, it's not like it's real money, Dan. Just click it. Boink! Okay. Ah, there we go. Well, okay, yeah, it's still available. Uh, I, I don't know who would want that at this point. Uh, when fully unlocked, it's a $200 value. It's a 
plus 10 levels. I suppose... Wait, do I have that? Holy crud, I do. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. We're just gonna go plain Jane here, since I've already gotten... Well, there's a question. Plus 10 levels. Would it just give me... Unlock Mastery Path, plus 10 levels. Hmm. Hmm. Nope. Boink! Are you sure you want to purchase this item? Oh, yes, I do. I right, brace for it. This I, I really hope they do some epic display of everything going retroactive and just getting this mountain of stuff thrown at me. Here we go. Three, two, one. Boink! Yes, Let's mountain start of stuff. Let's sizzle and see if you make it to the inferno. Oh, do I? Wait, what? Okay, do I get the packs? Oh! <laughs> More! <laughs> More! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> I love it! I love it! I don't know. Okay, I get gems for the ones that have already filled out play sets for, which I really wish I would have known what those were. That'd be interesting. Does it say? Can you figure out which one that is? Hmm. Hum, 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 hum. And there's my cosmetics. Oh, they're going to go into the cosmetics. Here we go. Ready for another explosion of stuff I just get. This is absolutely entertaining for me. This is why I purchased it. Not for the actual stuff for this moment here. I'm going to live it up. All those cosmetics. Ooh, yes. Mmm. With this, I will make the shiniest decks of all. And they will shine in my opponent's face, and I will win based solely off that. Yes. Okay. All right, ready? Ready? Next one. Boink! Oh. Oh, well, okay. Ten of those, or twelve of those. And my last cosmetic, which is Unsummoned. Which is something I do play every once in a while, so. Okay. Uh, so I guess the next point is, is hit that mastery tree. I'm just going to hit claim. Rise. Uh, we'll go into the path. Let's do the mastery tree first. Oh, I've got 12 of these suckers to place in. Now here's the one thing. As you can see, I've grinded, you know, for a couple of these, right? Uh, so the one thing I was disappointed, like, I got that one because I wanted it, which was, the, if I can remember, the Legion. No, no, this is Legion's end. Anyways, Vampire Dude, I was really hoping I could just skip, because I don't really want that, but I want that. Hmm, so, unfortunately, here's the first two. Boink, and... Ooh. Yay. Okay, next. Boink! Floaty Orby thing going. Wow, I got card shiny. <laughs> now, I didn't check out what are... Because black and white are two colors that I commonly play. So that's where it kind of like... Oh yeah, oh, I definitely want that one. Hanged Executioner is a fun card to play. Not ultimately the best, but for three... Damn useful. God's Willing. I don't think I've ever run this card yet. I don't even think I know what it does. But still, boink! Yes. Our Orzhov deck will be unmatched in shininess. And... Planar Cleansing. Oh, oh, come on. Boink! Yes. Good, good. The shininess continues. Well, now I have seven. I still have seven left. They have the suggested picks. I wonder what they would suggest. I don't know. Uh, okay. Yeah. There it goes. Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. Ooh. Now there's one I want. And what's the... Yeah. Well, that's the only one I really want out of blue. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, that's right. No. No. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, I'm not a huge fan of three-color decks, so the three-color ones are not really things I'm eager to get my hands on. 
and just not polished enough a player. Okay, let's take green to its final end. Uh, Lee Kindred, okay. Uh, ooh, Barkai Troll. Fun. Stompiness. Okay. Shifting Ceratops. And... Uh-huh. There's that one. I'm not even gonna... Pulse of... Murass... I murder so many words in this game. Shard summons. I just sharded. Ah, that's how immature I am. I'm sorry. Infuriate. Okay, I do love me some red. Unchained Berserker. Ooh. We want that one. Yes. Flaming or Flame Sweep. Okay, not bad. No, no, not bad. Okay, I think I just got my first copy of this from opening a pack, so immediately applies. Okay, so let's recap. Dungeon Geist, yeah, I could do three there and have four left. What did I have to do? There was nothing in green that I was absolutely drooling over. So, let's see, three, I have four left. I could go one, two, and uh, three. Well, let's do that then. We'll start out in blue. Actually, no, I'm going to start out in red, just to assure. Uh, Yay! Infuriate! I am infuriated right now. You have no idea how unchained my berserker will be. And... Boink. Nice. By the way, yeah, Kermit the Frog is here with us. Hi-ho! I'm about to play some Magic the Gathering. And... Boink! Alright. Sweet. Okay, now we'll go on this side to get it. Dungeon Guys is right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, uh, uh... Yes, sir. Boink! Mmm, winged words. As opposed to unwinged words, you know. That can be annoying. Cerulean Drake. Uh, well. Now, Cerulean Drake, I, I, I guess for two. It's not a bad card. I, I, uh, I get picky when it comes to blue flyers. Dungeon Geist, however. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Boink. Which Dungeon Geist immediately overthrows, uh, what is the other card? Uh, Chillbringer. Um, Chillbringer for five. You know, it's a 3-3 three, three for five, and it only, you know, taps your opponent's creature for one turn, whereas this taps it for always and forever. Well, until somebody gets rid of Dungeon Geist. Okay, I have one last one. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Should I just do... Yeah, I should. Just so green doesn't feel lonely. I don't know. What were the other... What were my next blue and red? Aethergeist and... Hmm. <coughs> hmm. What was that? Uh, yeah. You know what? Yeah. I don't necessarily want Flame Sweep, but... I do want repeated reverberation. Oh, Lord. Repeated reverberation. And I would also like me some Zenith. Mmm. Much better than the one we had as a kid. And... Boink! If you got that Zenith joke, there's a much, much more high fidelity, this card, than the Zenith I had as a kid. If you got that joke, you're old. You're very old. Oh man, I got packs to go through. Oh boy, do I have packs. Where should we start? Let's take it one at a time. Now, of these, uh, least excited about, Guilds of Ravnica, going into Core Set 2020. Uh, most excited about, War of the Spark, and... Ravnica Allegiance. These are my two faves right here. Oh, wait. The music changes. Hang on, wait, wait. <laughs> Hang on. Let's just play with the music.
Okay, I'm done being an idiot. I'm sorry. So, you know what? I'm just going to take it one at a time. Guilds of Ravnica. More or less, my disliking of Guilds of Ravnica is my guilds are not represented. Which, you know, I like, I like Rakdos. Rakdos is one of my favorites. I believe, wasn't it Allegiance that had Demir? I don't know. Anyways. So, oh, yeah, yeah. Conclave Guild Mage. There. Big stompy stomp. And we got an icon. Great. And what do we get? Oh, Chromatic Lantern. Which I really ought to be using more of. Anyways. Alright. Let's go on to a Allegiance pack here. Let's see what we got. Mm-hmm. These are good cards! <laughs> I'm just trying to do as many stupid impersonations. Maybe I should do the rest of this as Meatwad from Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Oh, the fool! I, 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 I'm not playing Magic the Gathering, because, uh, you know, you can play all kinds of cards. You got the Spence guy, he's pretty cool. Oh, 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 screw the credit card. This is kind of mean, and it's not that big card. Okay, I'll stop. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. I don't want to blow on the thing a little bit. Sorry, sorry. Alright, let's see what this guy is. Mmm. Mmm, -hmm -hmm. Best played in Cynic. Which is not necessarily something I play, although I've been attempting. Now, this is my all-time favorite of recent sets, um, more or less, because I can run pretty much Grixis colors, and if they just all, it's almost like idiot proof. If it says a mass, chances are it's going to work together. Uh -huh. It's a really simple aggro build. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah, these are cards. Pollen Bright Druid, uh, Pain in Thy Ass. Uh-huh, yep. Aww. My wild crafter. Ooh. Wait. I didn't get... Oh, no. You better be something with Dread Horde Invasion. Dread Horde Invasion. Enter the Gods Eternal. Oh. Uh -huh. uh, I don't... I don't think I have one of these yet. Ooh. Mow, 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 mow. Okay. Interesting. Now we'll go on to core. Why not? Why not? Core 2020. Here we go. Oh, we got Yoked Ox. This thing... Uh, if you thought a Johnny's Pride Mate was annoying, wait until people start playing you with a Johnny's Pride Mate and this thing in the deck at the same time. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, the rage. Pure... An adult and it's flying. It flies. Okay. What do we get? Yay! Uh, I'm just gonna get this out of the way. I get another ley line. I swear I'm gonna scream like a little girl who just spotted a mouse. Uh, Glaring Aegeus, okay, yeah, 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 yep, yep, he, I have underestimated this card, I've seen opponents play this, and then just outlast me to the point where I just want to concede, I don't, but I want to, alright, big money, big money, no whammy, no whammy, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I'm not hitting the cards I want, and it's interesting, that's for sure. Alright. Come on. You got a dragon mage for me in there somewhere. I know you do. Hey! Yay! Things happened. Yep, 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 yep. Frostlings, happy to see you back in the reprint. Eh, it's a pretty decent card. It's really not bad. Nah, I wish you would go away. I really would. Alright, ready? Ready? Once again, if you get this reference, you you two are are old like I am. Big money, big money, no whammy, no whammy, big money, no whammy. 
I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm not happy with that one. I'm all right. That's a good one. I like that one. Alright, uh, you know what? I'm gonna get guilds out of the way. I'm not excited about this. I mean, yeah. Oh, yeah, wait, no, it was guild that had all the Demir cards, but they. Okay. Not the Demir I wanna play, but that's a whole different. <laughs> it's my favorite. <laughs> this. This is probably, honestly, is the card designed by Snoop Dogg. It hit no fiddle. <laughs> uh, common wild card gay. Take the hunt. Okay. Pit, 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 pit. Yep. Okay. Okay. Let's try this again. Boink! Yeah. Mm, yeah. Not a bad one if you're going to play Celestia. Okay. Which I have kind of come around to Celestia. The ability to just jam the field with creatures and gain life at the same time. Okay, okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. He's a fun one. Yeah, not bad. And... Boink! Uh, uh, let's try that again. Ready? One, two, three. Boink! Yay! Uh, I rarely play mill deck. Um, I've attempted making a few. I just don't have the patience for it. I really don't. Now I'm gonna do that later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go, here we go. Mm -hmm. Hey, there we go. Yay. Uh, deface. Yeah, yeah. If you play this card, I will hate you till the end of time. I have no love for land destruction decks. It's just not fair. It's not fun. It's not how you make friends. But on Arena, I think few people are worried about politeness. Because I'm not worried about it, so... Uh, I don't expect others to be. Alright, ready? 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 Oi! Cinder Vines. Okay. That's not bad. Um, not something I readily play. You know? But, yeah. Okay. Mm, you know what? I'm gonna, yeah. Go right into this last one here. Man, I gotta tell you, I'm having a blast just just off that mastery pass. I'm so happy about that purchase. Alright, uh growth spiral, okay. Savage smash, okay. Ready, ready, ready? The anticipation. An e-ticket attraction. Okay, ready. One, two, three, boink! Okay! Unbreakable formation. I believe I already have a full set of the. No, I believe this is the fourth one. Okay, yeah. This is a card that I really do like. Um, that's a great one to play just in mono white, you know, go wide, fill up the battlefield kind of thing. And of course, more of the spark. Here we go. Let's finish this up. Yay! More wild cards. I'm apparently going to need them for historic. So that I can buy cards. Two to one. I don't know. I'm not even getting into that. I hope they change their mind on that. Uh, okay. I want other Dovin cards. Which aren't in War of the Spark, but whatever. Whatever. He ain't bad. He ain't bad at all. Uh, for three, that's pretty decent, really. Alright. <clears throat> Once again. It's that time. Three, two, one, point! Ooh. Yes. Now, I the deck I've been running recently um, that I really need to just switch up, I've been playing way too much, is uh, blue-black. Uh, Demir Amass, basically. I tried to make it full-color Grixis, but just didn't have the cards. Alright, ready? Plus that, no, okay, I will say this. Um, of the three colors that you can use for a mass tax, uh, being, you know, red, blue, and black, I, I gotta say, red, mm, kind of fun in it. Um, yeah, that really isn't much in the way, like, widespread brutality is a good one, but other than that, mm, mm, not a lot. Not really, no. 
not really good ones. Most of the good ones happen to be in blue and black. And of course, my all-time favorite card, uh, if you're running a mass, um, my favorite is Gleaming Overseer. You just cannot underestimate that card. It's so, it's so great. It gives you just the absolute ability to protect your horde, which, you know, it's vulnerable to a lot. Anyways, last pack. And then I, I found it. Well, shut up. Maybe. Kind of. Sort of. Alright. I got another thingy thing. And the thingy thing. Uh huh. Yep. This card is disappointing to me. It really is. Um. For four. I mean, man. If it wasn't for Controller Pays 2, I don't know. Maybe I'm being too picky. Um. Yeah, that's just not fun. Yeah, these two are not cards that I run. Uh, I guess a mass three. You know, if you're running Dreadhorde Invasion, that a mass three can really save you in a pinch, get you up to you know, up to that six or more, so you can gain health, but eh, keep you from like killing yourself. Anyways, let's see what this guy is. Ready? 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 I know you're ready for it. Boink! <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Don't complain, man. Just take it. Yay! Okay, so now that I've gotten that, I want to just take it. Yes, grow. Yes. Feel the hate consume you. Sorry. Sorry. So, yeah. As I stated before, I'm saving this up for when rotation happens. I can get Eldering, I can just start buying up singles that way. Alright, well that's about all I wanted to take you through today. Um, I'm trying to remember, was there something else? Well, let's take a last look at this here now. So, I am now down here. Okay, so wait, we're back on 60. Wait, I get 3 at 70? Ooh. Alright. Not that I'm really that jazzed about the cosmetics. <gasps> Wait, that's right, I have the catty cat now. Oh, my kitty cat. Oh, but that's 80? Oh, okay. I didn't mean to go backwards. So I'm right here right now at level 60. I'll probably end up getting up to 80. Um, and I consider it a value at that, at that price point. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, so 80 will be when I get the... Not that I really care. Ooh. And we get another one. Ooh. Chinese. Oh, yay. All right. Oh, right. That's it. Oh, well, and you know, and I made that purchase and I got my gems right back up. Uh, so I really didn't lose a ton. Kind of cut the cost of it, gaining all those gems back. Now I can actually go. Do some draft, which is guilds and core 20. Yay! I do need to play some more rank to get my rank up. Uh, Alright, well that is it for this video tonight. I hope you've had fun watching me spend my hard-earned gems to buy a bunch of fun stuff and giggle like a little, like a little, little nonsensical kid along the way. And, uh, so if you are interested in that mastery pack and you've been grinding all along, now you know it is retroactive. You can do that. It's fun. It's, to me, the value out of that was just watching everything flood up on the screen. That just made me all kinds of giddy and happy because I'm stupid like that. But if you like this video, you want to see some more of these types of videos, you have some comments about some of the things uh, that you saw on on this video or some of the cards some things that you'd like to play please hit me up in the comments below leave a comment uh if you are so kind hit me up with a like subscribe share give me a million dollars uh start a gofundme page just for me um send me your first golden child you know whatever you feel is appropriate but until then this is daniel luther hart aka Moron Iris signing out and have yourself a wonderful evening.